Uh, so Subnautica is going quite well today. We have found a new area that had kyanite in it, which is a r really rare material. It also had a uh, large eel monster that tried to eat me and nearly did. Uh, Fucker factor was at an all-time high. Mm. And then we found this uh, extra piece of wreckage that I did not expect to find. I thought we were kind of done, but I'm glad we did find it because there's PDAs in here with the story of the crew that got shot down. And it's really interesting. It's kind of fun. They have lots of good character. Adds more character to the game. I'm not sure how many of these reactors we're going to need, but we'll just keep taking those. This one might be a small one. Mm, oh, oh. Power cell. We'll always take that. We don't need any more of the, the orange thing. Oh, there's some music. Miracle of sound. The more I watch this game, the more interesting and creepy it becomes. It is quite creepy. You're lucky you missed the, the eel monster. He is not cool. He's real fast. Well, I mean, he's really cool, actually. Uh, he's probably one of the coolest designs so far that I've found in the game. Oh, there's a door over there. Maybe we can laser through. Uh, laser? No, maybe not. You never know with these doors. Come on, give me at least one PDA. We want the public display of affection. I want to know more about uh, the the two people that fell in love on their their journey down here into the dark. There's a shark post trying to eat me from outside. I guess there's nothing else, at least in this part of the hidey hole. And so, go back outside. Not sure what that is up there. Uh, it's just a regular little sharky boy. Uh, it's like a weird little grayfish guy. He's nothing to worry about. Let's get some oxygen. We'll look for another door in. Thanks for coming by, KetzyQ. I appreciate it. It's been kind of a slow, chill stream. I like it. It's nice to just be able to focus on the game. You know, to look at it from a half full perspective. Did you? Yeah, I don't think there's anything else in this. It's kind of a big for nothing rack here. Unless we can go in that hole there, but I don't think we can. You knock it off. I don't want to kill you, but I will. Shark to, put, oh, shark to squid? Yeah, it's a shark to squid over there. Chill streams are best to listen and, and watch at work, right? It's not all the... I've never been a, uh, a hype guy. I never liked really... Uh, watching the, the, that kind of stream either. I mean, I do sometimes, but uh, it's not my favorite. I like a nice relaxed stream. Um, Northern Lion is one that I like to watch. Basically all of the people in his circle, Northern Lion, Malf, uh, Dan Giesling, those guys are all, you know, nice relaxed streamers. Real, not so much Dan, he's kind of eccentric. Uh, we wanna go home. Home. Not that way. That way. How did this piece get so far away from the rest of the ship? The good news is it's right up against this, uh, this center point here. This is kind of the a big mound in the center of the area. And it makes it relatively easy to figure where exactly you're at. The loud hype streamers I like. Right? Right? They gotta also be positive i think which is rare that sounded like a oh, yep there he is i'm glad i looked that direction before continuing on that would have been a startling uh corner to turn just whoop, right into him 
Have him eat my face? No, thank you. Okay, and from there, I think we're home safe. That was the last big bad in between us and home. Jinx, maybe? We actually haven't done much exploring in this blue water area. Sorry, Pingu. Oh, no. I murdered a Pingu with my bad driving. Man, that's the second innocent creature I've murdered today. Killed a sea monkey. Um, I also really like a guy called Radamont. He's not as big as some of the other streamers, but he's like a medium level guy. But uh, I guess he's fairly big. He's He's got a lot of people that like to interact with him. He does cool things on his stream like... Uh, community guided playthroughs of games and stuff but he's my go-to streamer for sleepy time it's just nice and chill nice and chill relaxed voice talking about the game that he's playing nothing too crazy Joop. all right uh we're back at the base we need to well, we'll see what we can make and what we can't. First thing we got to do is get this inventory inside. Uh, da -da. We'll take these bladder fish in and make more water. So we're going to need a little resupply. We kind of drained it all out. Luckily, we got lots of spiral clippings. Mm, power cells will just leave one in here one battery in here maybe two batteries in here Ooh, we're full already uh, da -da -da -da. back inside we go Welcome aboard, we need to have a base day soon where I actually build this base out the way I want it mm hmm We're going to need more inventory already. I just built two more lockers. Oh, never mind. We're okay. <laughs> this one's totally empty. Uh, there's our peeper friend. Hello, peeper friend. Um, meow. Meow, meow. Everything's kind of just getting full up. Battery, can you go on the charger? You can. There's no real reason to do it, but we'll do it anyway. Chinese potato plant. You need to go live. Well, for now, I'm going to put them in the egg container. And then it needs to go in the garden. Or we'll just take it the rest of the way. We need to make you a place to live, Chinese potato plant. Do, do, do. Well, now what? Let's make the water so we can take it back out to the ship. We don't have uh, purified water yet. Filtered water. Whatever it is. Hmm. Makes me think maybe we should make the water filtration system. Hmm? Phone? Did your phone go off? No, the phone did not go off. Hmm. Ooh, reinforced dive suit. Heavy synthetic fiber dive suit provides more physical protection and enhanced survival. So this is like the, the do everything dive suit. That's pretty cool. I'm glad we found that. Uh, still suits the one that we take a pee in and then we get super cool water. Mmm. Makes you thirsty, doesn't it? Mmm. That's pretty easy to make, though. And we have synthetic cyber fibers and we can make a bunch of them now, too. So that's great. It's all good. Reactor rods, parallel processing unit. Glad we got that. The test override module we also need. So we're going to make that to make this. Um, yeah, see, here's the mercury, too. 
this is uh the one arm i guess that we just found or maybe that's a piece of the back engine i don't know here's the story so far that as, as far as i can tell from the the mercury 2 they came to the planet and they discovered a alien tech on the planet they scanned it and uh when they got closer they got shot at like everybody else but this time their captain was like he or she was super experienced and kind of a badass and saved them from getting shot down and murdered at least completely they were still damaged and they managed to land on the planet um once they were there they started fixing the, the ship why they sent crew off to go investigate the um the situation do we need another power cell stored here we do not need to put these away um joop, joop, joop. you come with us you come with us more waters going here battery 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 health kit pack all right all things are shaping up got another health pack here mm, okay so they got shot down they started fixing their ship up they sent the the people to go look for the alien tech and they ended up finding fish that ate them and they got infected with the disease um so they fixed their ship they said we got to get out of here and whoop, yeah that's coming and that's coming we'll get the rest in a minute they left their sick crew in a cave somewhere, which we actually have not found yet. I'm sure you can. I'm sure you can find a cave with like bodies in it and stuff. Um, and then they tried to take off. And when they tried to take off again, they were assuming that or hoping that whatever shot them down in the first place would just let them leave. It did not let them leave. And so they got blasted again this time not able to dodge and they crashed and i think everybody died you 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 food why are you in here food um boop copper wire can all go in the copper container the lithium oops that comes back. Where's my diamond container? I'm not entirely sure. Not entirely sure. We'll put that in here. That in there. Bloop, bloop. 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 Bloop, bloop. Bloop. Fine. That's fine. We have too much food. And so that's the story of the Mercury 2. Shot down they're in pieces and that's where they lay at the bottom of the ocean kind of sad but i mean it is the story of 4546b prior to subnautica 1 when we finally fixed the planet and shut off the the cannon that keeps blasting everybody down uh where is the last stuff here that we wanted to take this needs to come. This needs to come. Just double check. Double check everything. Yeah, I think we're okay here. Now we just need to empty out the prawn suit. And then we can start to build them. Yeah, the Degasi was the second known ship now to come here. It came here after the Mercury. Um, they, not too long before the Aurora came, hard to say exactly how long, um, they came and they got shot down and three survived, the captain, his son, and their security officer. And they were staying on land, but then they started to get sick, so they thought perhaps they could find the cure as they adventured deeper down under the water. Um, they did not find the cure. They just found 
more critters that eventually attacked them and, and almost killed them. Come to find out, the security officer killed the Leviathan and somehow managed to survive by living on top of it. Oops. This needs to go in that, not out of it. Now come back. Oh, we have copper wire that can go in there. There we go. Um, zoop. It's a mix of things. That's a mix of things. It's just turning into a big old mess. Zoop. Stepped out. Uh, back at base. Found a leviathan? Yeah, she found it. Well, a leviathan found them. And she killed it and rode on it and then put its skull in her base that she has in this one. Let's just tell them the story of the Degasi. The ship that got shot down before all of the Subnautica games started happening. Boop. Let's refresh all our batteries. That one's refreshed. Hmm. Mm, three. Refresh. Refresh. Excuse you. Okay, we need to get more batteries. We got them. Got lots of good, healthy batteries over here. Yeah, was, she's pretty hardcore. Um, it seems, and this is just a guess at this point, that she kind of took it upon herself to be like the the protector of the planet after everybody left, and she didn't she didn't ever encounter our our character in the first one. She was missing at that point. I'm assuming she was just living down here in the Arctic area, far away from all that action. Um. We're already at 100% on this one. Why am I switching this battery? Oh, never mind. Switched it with a dead one. She's a pretty hardcore lady. Um, but I think she's been waging war with Altera on this planet. Trying to spook them, go Scooby-Doo style and like spook them off the planet. And I think she may have accidentally killed our sister. That's my theory though. Um, all the Altera bases that are around here are all destroyed. They're all, uh, like, blown up and the glass is broken out of them and everything. And, you know, nothing on the land really could do that, at least in the area that the bases are in. Vital signs stabilizing. So that leads me to think, uh, She's the one who did that to try to get them to go away. Doop -doo -doo. Just make sure we got everything out of the prawn suit. Yes, we did. Okay, inventory managed. Mischief managed. We did it. Welcome aboard, Captain. Um, but right now she wants us to prove that we're not an Alteran, somebody who works for the Altera company, by taking this device and shutting off their scanner on the planet so they won't be able to track her location anymore. Ooh, afterburner upgrade. That sounds nice. That sounds real nice. We need to make the grappling suit arm. We need to make the depth module Mark II's. The story is super in-depth. There's a lot to it. You just have to kind of like follow it around and uh, and find the little pieces of it as you go. But uh, our character actually came here. She was working for a different company, not Altera. And she came here to support Altera. I guess they got bought out, but mostly she came here because her sister was on the planet working for Altera and ended up dead. And she thought Altera was lying about what happened. Which we don't know if they were or not yet so far. It, I mean, we found the location of where she died. We found a lot of her research work that she was doing. 
Um, she was working to make sure that the cure was in hand in case Altera decided to do something janky with the piece of the, the virus that was on the planet. They found a piece of it. Uh, and they wanted to weaponize it and sell it. So she wanted to find the cure first and get rid of the virus not only on this planet, but make it like a, a known cure so that uh, Altera couldn't do that. Oh, baby boy. My baby boy is in the other room. Very sad for some reason or another. Oh, boy. He's probably sleepy. It's past his nap time and he has not slept yet. All right, um, depth module mark two we have for the truck. We need to make the mark three, which we actually, we can, we can make that surprisingly. So we might as well in it. Um, other things we need, we don't need these. I want them, but we don't need them. So we're not gonna do that. See truck horsepower upgrade, check. We need that fun afterburner upgrade need it for fun um don't need the thermal reactor on account of we have a ion battery in there and can pretty much live forever with no power no need to refuel the power for fun exactly we need it these are things that we need uh, let's see what else. That's pretty much this entire base is just for fun. I want to build a room off of this right here. That'll be like a bedroom that'll be in the center of it. And I want to make it all glass. It's going to be neat. It's going to be real neat. This other one over here, I'm going to get rid of that roof. And I'm going to put a, um, observatory on top of it. I think that'll be cool. That's the, the building that I started in. And most of... Well, I think all of my power actually still comes from that. I just put solar panels around it and it's been fine. Kind of nice. Not have to worry about that. Mm. Water filtration machine we need to make at some point. We don't need it. That's that's one thing we probably need, but we don't want that much. <laughs> Alien containment would be good. I need a place for a little, uh, little Larry the, the fish to live. Hmm. Interesting, interesting. Five glass. That's like 10 quarts. Jeez. 10 quarts and two titanium. It's a lot of quartz. We could just make a little aquarium instead. Jukebox. We haven't made any of this stuff. That's for that's for house day. I'm telling you, we're gonna do that maybe next week. We're getting close to the end of the game, so it's probably time to finish off the base. Mm. Well, let's build this stuff for now, and I think that'll be a good. Good start. We can look through the blueprints after that and see if there's anything else. <gasps> look at that. Root pustle times two. Guess who got two root pustles? I didn't even need new. I didn't even know that I needed it, but we got them. I found it and it said like usable for something. So I was like, oh, I'll just take that. Wait a minute. Only get one. I thought I got two. Oh, my snootiness has betrayed me. It's okay. I know where they find them. They're down in the little, the little monkey area. Sea monkey area. Yep. Ah, uh, my snootiness bites me in the butt once again. Hydrochloric acid. Hmm. I think we need that for benzene. Oh, and if you're not going off right now, you need to stop vibrating. Are you vibrating? It's not my phone. What the heck is vibrating on my table? Droop it. I can feel it through my keyboard. Computer, are you exploding right now? Please don't. It would be very, very sad. My timer's not going off. 
and it doesn't vibrate, so that would be really weird. Let's start with... Oh, wait, we didn't blueprint mark the depth module for... My... Depth module for... A front suit. Did I? No, I did not. That's something I actually needed. I was too busy clicking on the fun stuff. Okay. Enhances safety, does not stack. Aww. Can I... Stairs? Uh-oh. Stairs? Stairs? You betray me! My greatest enemy. The stairs. Okay, well. We made it out. We made it out anyway. They can't keep us in. Come here, you. I'm gonna put you inside. Doop a doop. Got so much to make. Hopefully, we have enough to do that. We're going to start with the depth module mark one. Three ruby, enamel glass, and synthetic fibers. Synthetic fibers. One, two, three ruby. Enameled glass is, I believe, diamond. Diamond, lead, and glass. Yeah. Good job, me. Diamond, check. <sighs> Don't tell me we're out of lead again. This runs. Wait, this happens to us every time we try to build something. Out of lead. The most difficult and annoying resource to get in the game. We have one lead. Oh no. Okay, that's the only enameled glass I'm seeing on the list, though. So, we could be lucky this time. Could be. Could be lucky. Enameled glass, check. Now we can make our on suit mark one upgrade. Check. Um, now we need to make the mark two upgrade, which will be a mod. She truck on suit in it. Unpin the other one. Hmm. Kyanite and two nickel ore. We'll just make it. Mm, maybe we'll make it. Gotta find the nickel. Two nickel and a kyanite. Where is it? Where'd I put it? Where to go? There you are. Bam. That easy. That easy. No problem. Um, next is the grappling arm. We need to make benzene. What? Oh, wrong button. Two flowering spores and a ribbon plant. Ribbon plant. Flowering spores. Probably going to be over here. One, two. Oh, we're really we're riding the lightning here, folks. Right on the edge and not having just the few rare resources that we need to actually progress here. Benzene check. Um... Thought we picked one of these up. Uh, maybe it was just the regular wiring kit. Okay, well, what do we need to make the advanced? We need a wiring kit and... Computer chip, which is gold and table quarrel. Quarrel? Gold, copper wire, and two table coral. 
Well, we got the copper wire right over here. And the table quarrel. Somewhere. Image of my timers beeping at me. Yes, thank you. Is it one or two? Two. Computer chip. Check. Advanced wiring kit. Check. Um, meow, meow, meow. Uh, two titanium and a lithium. Let's go. We're almost there. Two titanium. Lithium. Hmm? Grappling arm. Yes. Let's go. All right. Prawn suit now has the... Mark II upgrade for the prawn suit, which I think is the highest that goes. Yeah, prawn suit Mark II. So we just need this little guy. Class steel ingot is five titanium and a lithium or two lithium. Which we already have a titanium ingot. So we'll just take the titanium ingot and the lithium Wait, is there lithium in these extra ones? Lithium, there is. Okay, last steel ingot, check. Uh, three nickel ore and two kyanite. And then I'm gonna be able to go as deep as the game will allow me. Gosh, we're much farther into the game than I thought we were. What was it? Three nickel? A nickel. I'm talking about nickel. Where the heck did I put my nickel? Hmm. Hmm. I gotta be looking right at it, yeah? Nickel. I thought we had a bunch of you. We did. One, two, three. And two kyanite. Also over here. Why do I keep going back over there? Is it not? There it is. One, two. Unfortunately, I don't think these uh, make the sea truck all that more powerful. All the diving, right? Time to do the deep exploration. We got it. Got to get down in there. It's kind of scary. I need like a hull upgrade for this so that it doesn't uh, it doesn't break as easy. It's a little Captain. scary how much damage it takes sometimes, and if I lost it, it was destroyed, would be a heartbreaker. All I have is the horsepower upgrade, which allows me to tow more rooms attached to it, which is a plus and a minus. It's great that I can have like a little mobile vehicle base, kind of. Boy, is it tricky to navigate through the little hidey holes if you uh, try to take it somewhere. I think the best thing to do is to actually just disconnect. So you have like a bedroom, you have uh, your fabricator and your aquarium or whatever for funsies. And then you can just disconnect that when you don't need to take it any farther. And then you have your prawn suit and your, your sea truck that can go down deeper and you just leave the rest up above up above hmm which may be something that I do later but sea truck mark three prawn suit mark two grappling arm we're getting close getting close to having upgrades finished and ready to rock give you a little touch up Got the jump jet upgrade storage. Grappling arm check. Uh, depth module mark two. Just needs one more upgrade. Wonder what I should make for it. We have the thermal thing, which might be nice for when we get down deep, keeping our power up, especially if we get leeches later. 
Hmm. Maybe that's what we do. That's the only other thing we have. Can't ban it because it's full. Okay, well, we need to make the... Afterburner upgrade, right? Is that the one we just... What did we just make? Sea mm, truck depth module. We needed a wiring kit and an advanced wiring kit. That's a lot of silver. Four silver. One, two, three, four. Mm, a lubricant and a lithium. So we need three more lithium, two crystalline sulfur. Mm, power cell. We actually we're just gonna use one that we already have. One, two. How much lithium? One. We need three lithium. Okay, so that's done. Uh, that just needs a lubricant, and that'll be done. Wait a minute. We have a, a wiring kit already. Cool. Well, put two silver back then. Two silver goes back. Um, we need a computer chip, right? For the other piece. One, two, three. A gold thing and a copper wire. Whooper. Whooper. Boom. Let's make it. Computer chip. Uh, advanced wiring kit. Done. Wiring kit. Done. Now we just need a lubricant and a power cell. Always need lubricant. Especially if you're trapped all alone on a planet by yourself. So won't we? I am so won't we? Um. Power cell? That's a battery. That's a titanium rod. That's a nothing? There's all my power cells. Jeez. Too many. Sea truck upgrades. Horsepower upgrade, afterburner upgrade. I like afterburners, that sounds cool. But no, like, integrity mod. That's the other thing that I need for myself, actually. That done.